All right, time for the latest H3VR update, which is update 100. Wow, 100 updates to this game. Uh, I don't exactly remember when I got into it. I think uh, it was update... I don't know. I gotta look... Uh... I don't remember. It was the new arena prototype, right? But whatever. So 100 updates in. We're finally out of the alpha. Got some cool stuff. And uh, it's all rolled into the uh, the actual update. So let's just check out what's new with this uh, update. And first off, we've got the new toy here. The Ultimax 100. Appropriate, because this is the 100th update. But there you go. Let's look at that in the light. Nice little light machine gun. Although this one uses a drum mag as such. And uh, yeah. So let's fire this thing off. Let me set this up. Let's go uh, 10 meters. Oop. One meter. <laughs> 10 meters away. So yeah, Ultimax. I've never um, personally don't know much about this one. Uh, I know it's Singaporean from Singapore, I think. Uh, I should have looked at the uh, Wikipedia for this, but uh, yeah, it's a light machine gun. It's got drum mag. And let me go through the controls. So left on the touchpad, which is from safe to fully automatic, obviously. And uh, let's see, we've got ourselves a uh, carry handle. Cool. No other controls. Down on the touchpad releases the mag, which is pretty cool. I kind of like it already. Uh, instead of the uh, usual belt box, which you have to fumble around with, this is just a magazine, so you can just stick it in there. No other controls necessary. Uh, yeah, those are the only controls. Left on the touchpad and down. There's a charging handle here. We open up the uh, little dust cover there. And got a foregrip. Bipod. Don't forget about that. So, if you want to mount this on something, you can. And from what I've heard and what I've seen, especially from the devlog is that this thing is super accurate and uh, has low recoil, something like that. So let's go and check it out. Same down the sights. Oh man, okay, let's uh, Let's go to one meter here. Let's uh, see our results. Yeah, that's pretty accurate for a light machine gun. Oh, hold on. Let me just check my... Oh, you know what? I completely forgot. Uh, let me see. My audio levels are fine. Good. Right. Okay. And I forgot to do this. Here's the spectator. Boom, boom, boom. Left camera eye. Because I'm left-handed. All good? Yes. I got so excited to play that I forgot to do those options. But, yeah. There's your Ultimax. I think it has a bolt hold open. So, the last round uh, holds the bolt open. Or, wait, hold on. Let me just... Uh, let me go to 5 meters here. Reset the target. Let's just fire from the hip. Not quite from the hip, but uh, you know what I mean, right? Yeah, so it does have a bolt hold open. Which is pretty cool. Makes reloading a lot easier. Alright, you know what? I will change the target. Let's, uh, let's go with a... Uh, Chilouette style here. And uh, let's keep firing, because this thing's pretty fun. Yep. I'm, I'm going to use this a lot, then. <laughs> Too bad it doesn't have any uh, rails or anything like that. Although I do wonder. Uh, we'll go to that in a minute. Oop. Let's just get rid of this. We'll go to the old item spawner first. We'll talk about the new one soon. But uh, let's see. Attachments... 
Uh, suppressor. Let's get ourselves a suppressor. Corded. Let's try corded. Stick this on there. Yes, it does. Actually, you know what? A laser would be really nice. Let's get a rail adapter in here. Let's do a... Hmm... Barrel extender. Go barrel extender. Stick that on there. Suppressor, obviously. And, uh... Wanted to see if I could, uh... Yeah, maybe, maybe we'll extend this thing a bit back. Add ourselves a, uh, hmm. Should I put a red dot on this thing? Or just a laser? You know what? I'll just do a laser. Get that. We'll just do this. Let's get rid of this. And we will stick ourselves a laser. Uh... Hmm, maybe this would be a good, uh, good, good attachment. Stick a suppressor on there. And we'll stick a laser. All right. There's an attack laser. Stick that on there. Ooh, there we go. Now we can, now we can see how accurate things are. All right. Let's fire from the hip again. Yeah, this thing is uh, this thing is really accurate due to that uh, recoil. Oh, I just love it that the uh, bolt just locks back open. That is pretty cool. Makes reloading in, like I said, easier. So yeah, see that is that is really accurate. Just a little little jump up and. Although my hands are wandering, I know that. But uh, yeah, wow, what a gun for update 100. That is pretty cool. The Ultimax 100. <laughs> we'll just call it the Ultimax from now on. Oh yeah, this one, I forgot to mention that the sights can be adjusted. You don't need to, because usually the ranges we're firing in this game are usually that close, but if you want to do some long-range shooting, get up to 600 meters. And yeah, there you go. Put this on safe. There's your Ultimax. Ooh, look at that. Look at that uh, carrying handle. Just flowing in the wind. <laughs> but uh, yeah. Oh, yeah. Forgot about the bipod. Or I, I mentioned it. I didn't use it. But there you go. That's the Ultimax. We'll try to get a little bit of time with that soon. I do have some time today, so I might play some Take and Hold. But let's go and check out... Oops, that is the laser dot. Let's go and check out some of the uh, new additions to the uh, new item spawner. So we've got the old one back there, which is going to be phased out eventually, one of these days. So there is... Uh, let's see. There was an update during the middle of the week, because it's Thanksgiving, and a lot of people would have been playing, you know, or at least uh, on Thanksgiving Day, Maybe on Black Friday, which should be today for a lot of people out there. But they probably got some new hardware. So Anton decided to give us a simple mode. Well, a, a simple mode, I think it's a classic mode. It's, it's called classic mode in the game. A classic, uh, classic item spawner. So basically now it's a lot uh, easier, which is understandable. We got a lot of new players coming in for the holidays, especially Thanksgiving, and maybe next month for... Uh, Christmas or Meatmas. So we've got a classic mode, which, uh, you know, simplifies things, which, uh, you know, it's cool. It's cool. I'm, I prefer this one, but again, I've been playing the game for a long time, so it's not that complex for me. But again, this is for the new players and for, you know, some of the other players who like the old item spawner. But yeah, as you can see, it's a lot more um, simple, a lot more easier to uh, get around in. And, uh, yeah. 
pistols, revolvers, all all of the uh, categories in one one section. All the firearms. So uh, that's that's pretty cool. Uh, let's see. Machine guns, grenade launchers. Oh yeah, and Anton said he uh, split up the uh, the uh, ordnance, which I don't know if it's uh, reflected in the item spawner here. Yeah, it is. So this all used to be in one category. I think uh, ordnance, grenade launchers, rockets, uh, remote explosives, and our locomotion guns. But uh, now that he's uh, modified it so that those are different categories. Muzzle loading. <laughs> Whoops. Although I do, I do, I would suggest one one change would be to uh, oops, not that one to put the back button up here. I don't know, just a just a little thing, just a very nitpicky thing, but uh, just to move this over here is instinctively. I think that's how it worked in the old Ina spawner. Yep, the back button is up here I, again. Muscle memory for me when you click on something and you want to go back, you go. Top left, right? <laughs> Top left, right, whatever. But yeah, since uh, this is over here now on the top right, or at least right center, I guess. Uh, muscle memory, I, <laughs> I went to tag search mode instead. So, But uh, yeah, I think this needs to move over here. Just, you know, just a little suggestion. Uh, again, this is for new players mostly, so they'll probably have to get used to this. But for long-time players, I guess that might be a thing. <laughs> this is over here, back to categories. So, yeah. But, uh, yeah, uh, as you can see, all, all the stuff is here, represented. Um, hmm. Just making sure, just checking. Eat fortress stuff. Okay. Oh, yeah, I was about to go up up left again. Now it's, it's back... And to the, uh, it's up and to the right. But yeah, cool, cool, simple mode. I'm, I'm going to probably use this because, uh, you know. Oh, the Ultimax is not in the update 100. That's, uh, that's an oversight right there. <laughs> that's okay, you know. All right, so, yeah. Let me just uh, clear this. Uh, let's see, category... We'll go with assault rifle. Oh no! Wait. You know what? Um, machine or a light machine gun, right? Let's see. LMG machine gun. There we go. All right, Ultimax. There it is. I, you know, you have to get used to it, but. Uh, I find, you know, I like this one. But again, classic mode is still good, still good too. So, it all depends on what your what your preference is. Uh, okay, so, uh, yeah. So, classic mode, we'll talk about that. That's pretty cool. We finally get an ammo page, which uh, still is under construction. At least uh, we have the magazine images, but for specific ammo, like cartridges... I think that's the new thing. Cartridges are uh, the new addition to the item spawner here. Which, uh, yeah, Anton decided to add because somebody asked for it. And, uh, yeah. So we have cartridges. They don't have any images yet because Anton said that he's still got to uh, make all those. Which is probably going to be a very, very uh, tough and long pro process. Because there's like 318 of these uh, rounds in the game. Just as much as there are many guns, there are a lot of rounds. Dark matter, lemon. Hmm. What's the difference between dark matter and the uh, sustenance? That's kind of strange. This is the sustenance. And this is the dark matter. Hmm. That, uh, I think that needs to be fixed as well. They're both the same. So, yeah. <laughs> dark matter and sustenance. Okay, so that's, uh, yeah. Again, uh, needs a little bit more work, but uh, that's, you know, that's what this game is. It's early access. It's gonna, it's still under development, so. But there are a lot of rounds, so I can understand why uh, <laughs> a lot of these aren't, uh, don't have images yet, or are not, uh, are not, uh, you know, kind of ready yet. But yeah, we got ammo, so now you can spawn. 
it'll be really crazy one day to see all of these pictures like filled right <laughs> instead of the generic bullet logo we uh, we get pictures of uh, each each shell again there's 318 of them so <laughs> that's going to be a lot of work oh man that's going to be a lot of work for anton i don't i don't envy him you know i feel i feel kind of bad <laughs> but that's just the nature of game development i suppose so yeah ooh 300 blackout tracer Yep, it's, uh, just checking, seeing if there's anything in here that's uh, hidden. <laughs> there's some rounds that are uh, not in the item spawner, but I think they're in here now. Let's see. 10 millimeter DSM. That's for the um, the Blade Runner gun, Decker's Blaster, uh, LAPD 2019. That's what it's called. Um. Got the imaginary. That's for the Degel. Boomy. <laughs> oh, man. So much ammo, too. You don't realize it, but there is a lot of ammo in this game. Uh, 12.7. Hmm. I'm trying to remember. Isn't that the um, anti-material? I'm pretty sure that's the, let's see. Oh, no, that's 20.82. Okay. Yeah. All right. Well, whatever. That's fine. 12.7. I'm trying to remember what gun that goes to. Huh. Huh. It's, it's coming to blank in my head. Uh, Wind mag. That's 22 wind mag. Hmm. 38 round. A shet. A metal jacket. Okay, yeah. I'm just checking. Just, uh, just seeing uh, if there's anything in here. 20 millimeter caseless. I think that's for... Yeah, that's for the uh, Russian grenade launcher. forgot what it's called. <laughs> Again, blanking. I can't remember. Uh, let's see, 600 Magnum, 5.56, standard, let's see, 7.62, hmm, 9 by 19, compound pistol, ah, there it is, okay, so that is, yes, oh yeah, that's the compound pistol from the game compound, <laughs> this was, I think this is the CB... P whatever it was called used to be uh, I don't know if Anton added a tag for it but uh, all right cool that's ammo for you and uh, of course attachments got their own little separate uh, things so bipods now suppressors all uh, the muzzle brakes and muzzle adapters have been removed from the, uh, the suppressors category I think Muzzle attachments, that's what they were like generally, but uh, they've been split up, which is cool. Rail adapters, foregrips, bipods, decorative. Yes. Yes, everything is there. Oh, again, muscle memory. <laughs> that back button should be over here. The muzzle brakes, yes. Okay, muzzle adapters, yep, we got that. Oop. Suppressors, pretty cool. Lasers and lights. Yep. Yeah, everything's there. Melee stuff is still here. Although Anton hasn't really added any new melee weapons in a while, so let's not go to that. But if I remember correctly, Anton made a new category for... Wait, let me just check something out here. Mm-hmm, okay. Got utility, nice. Well, we'll get to this in a minute. Don't worry about it. I'm just checking through and seeing if there's a... Uh... Huh, that is... Oh, there it is. Meat Fortress. Okay. Rail hats, which I unlocked all of them. If I remember correctly. Oh, come on. Backpacks. Core shoes. All right, so... Anton finally added all the Sosa guns into the item spawner, which has uh, been a long time coming. So now... You can, uh, hey, wait a minute, isn't this, uh, Metal Gear? 
This is, um, yeah. There we go. Oh, man. Okay, no, I'm not going to do that. My hand is cramping up now. Ooh. Uh, yeah, you have to shake to reload some of these. Or most of these, right? So, but the Sosa guns are in the item spawner, finally. And we've got the meat, for uh, meat fortress ones, too. So you don't have to worry about that. <laughs> the PSG one. That's, uh, again, I think that's, um, was added with Metal Gear. If I remember correctly. Or Metal Gear. Uh, the flaccid stake, right? Remember the character. Okay. But yes, so all the Sosa guns uh, currently in the game are in here. Even including the ones that we checked out like a while ago for the uh, meatness contest. So we've got all the cool stuff. We've got, uh, oh, there's the F2000 for all you F2000 fans out there still wanting it in the game. <laughs> but uh, we also got some, uh, some, I think what, um, most of them are, a lot of them, I think, have uh, suppressed versions now. So uh, let's see. This one's suppressed. Uh, this one, the F2000. Suppressed uh, EBR, six, M16. Uh, the Mac 11 was in there. Oh, no, it wasn't suppressed, right? I'm trying to remember if it was. I don't think it was. Uh, is this a suppressed revolver? Huh, hold on. I mean, I'm not saying that those don't exist. Obviously, they do, but... There we go. Cool. <laughs> it is a suppressed revolver. I think the Scout was already suppressed. Here's the PSG-1, which should be over here, but that's okay. That's cool. Yeah, so a lot of these have uh, suppressed variants, I want to say. So that's pretty cool. Uh, BR, those are like World War II uh, classic weapons. Yep. Yeah. So, yeah, all the uh, Sosa guns are in here now. And you can play with them to your heart's content. Let me just reload this. Cool. So I think that's all about the the new item spawner, which is looking pretty good so far. Let me raise the height here. But uh, yeah, all right, we got that checked out. You know what? Since I have time today. I'm going to play some Take and Hold. And yeah, let's just get to it. And uh, let's uh, do some Take and Hold. Now, I don't know if I want to do the smaller map or the um, Northern Dakota. But let's go through our settings here. Class at stake. I do have the PSG-1 now. Uh, no. You know what? We'll go with a... Um, go with a, Let's go with Ricky Dicky Random. And uh, let's go with... Uh, should I do Northest Dakota? Hmm. We'll do Classic Hallways. We'll just do that. And we'll go with... Uh, Sequence four, do five hold standard. Uh, spawn lock enabled. Okay, that's fine. I just want to have fun today, so. Okay. Target mode. Oh, should I do no targets? Yeah, you know what? I'll do no targets. I just want to shoot off some guns. So, uh, yeah, we don't need Sosa gun reloading. Everything's fine. Everything's good. All right. Let's do it. Oh, do I have the item spawner? Yes, I do. Okay. All right, let's go and do this. I still got charge of my uh, controllers, so got two bars left on each of them. So, 
just gonna... I should sit down and wait. This is gonna take a while to load. <laughs> Computer is not doing... Is uh, not as young as it used to be. So we'll be here waiting for a bit. Mm -hmm. Just waiting for my computer to load all the data. Oh, there we go. Uplink successful. Target system detected. Take it. All right. Well, we're going to have fun today. So let's grab ourselves the uh, Ultimax, if I can find it. Support. Machine gun. There it is. There it is. Stick this on the shoulder. Okay, cool. Let's see what we got for our first weapon here for Ricky. Oh, this is the um, RPK. <laughs> All right, fine. Sure, why not? Oh, and we also have a war grip for this. See if I can stick this on there. It's been a while since I did this. There we go. Okay, cool. We are ready. Let me just get things set up here. Uh, and let's go clear that supply room. Oh, here we go. Override token found. <laughs> Even though I'm not running limited ammo, I just did a tactical reload. All right. Let's uh, grab a weapon here. Let's just spawn as many things as we can. Hey, we've got ourselves a uh, AKM tactical. <laughs> that's, uh, that's fun, right? Got ourselves an AKM tactical. I know I should be using the Ultimax, but uh, uh, whatever. That's fine. Let's use the Ultimax. <laughs> Alright, whatever. Let's, let's just keep going. It doesn't matter. I just want to shoot today because uh, I was a little busy. And I finally got home and there was a fresh new update for me to play around with. So, well, yeah, I mean, just to check out, you know, the Ultimax and the uh, new item spawner stuff. But, yeah, okay, here we go. Should be. It's been a while since I played this map too, so it's, I'm getting lost here. All right, here we go. Here we go. Can you? Oh, you know what? I want to try something out. Can you? No, you can't. That was a uh, <laughs> mag palm, the uh, drum mag, obviously. Realistically, you can't, but if I know, if I remember better hands, you could uh, do large mags like that. All right, let's do it. Interfacing with system node. Hold this position. If I run out of ammo, I'm going to switch to the AK or the RPK.
Whoops, that was weird. Did I not uh, spawn lock a magazine? Okay, well, that's not good. Okay, cool. We're all good. We're all good. We're all good. We are all good. I forgot the spawn lock. The AKM mag. That was very silly of me. All right. Okay. Moving on. Let's go clear these supply rooms. I should maybe I should have put targets on. Oh man. Since I'm gonna use all these guns, I might as well have more targets other than Sosigs. But that's okay. You know what? We'll be fine. Ah. Oh. I don't know why, but my hand keeps cramping now. That is the worst. Oops, uh-oh. What's going on over here? Okay, cool. Coolio. Let's move this out of the way. We can upgrade our magazines. Can we do that? Let's see. Do I stick a gun on here? Uh, yeah, it's been a while since I played. I'm sorry. No, that's not going to work. Aha. Let's see. What do I do? Duplicate magazine, upgrade magazine, upgrade magazine. Oh, there we go. And I don't have any space for this, so that's going to be a problem. Should I? Do I have enough uh, credits? Hmm. Yeah, that'll work. Fine. Yeah, extended magazine for that. Which, uh, don't know why. I have a feeling that I already had an extended magazine for that. That's okay, though. Okay. <laughs> nice of them to wander into my, uh, my field of view there. We're going down. Oop, here we go. Oh, I should use the Ultimax. Token found. All right. Well, I do not have any space on me, which is not good. So I'm not going to buy anything. Couple more coming. Also, I am standing really close to my wall. I need to find the center of my play space. All right. Okay. Good enough. Good enough. Let's do this. Interface 
interfacing with system node. Hold this position. Analyzing system. <laughs> no, that's not going to work. That was weird. Yeah, maybe I should have turned tar uh, targets on. This is like a, a very, um, whoops, wait a minute. This gun kind of reminds me of the Thompson. Especially the drum mag, but uh, so the foregrip, you know? Wait, wait, no, I'm, I may be wrong. Uh, I'm kind of, uh, whatever, uh, you know, it doesn't matter. <laughs> yeah, no, it kind of does, right? Kind of reminds me of the Thompson. This is a really good gun. <laughs> this is a, this is a little too overpowered. All right, you know what? Let's switch over to the uh, AKM. Why? Why? <laughs> RPK time. Whew. Okay. Cool, cool, cool. Did I just drop my Ultimax? I don't know why I did that. I was wondering why my Ultimax wasn't there. I managed to drop it on the ground. All right. Well, let's go and see if I can uh, get rid of some of these weapons. Where'd you go? Getting close to a hold point here.
We got ourselves a recycler, I think. Ouch. My hands are cramping up. This is... All right, let's recycle some of this stuff that I don't need and see if we can find something equally fun. I'm keeping the Ultimax. Oops. Uh, I'm going to get rid of the AKM. Override token found. All right, let's see what we got here. What do we got? All right. The M1 Garand with the uh, experimental <laughs> scope. Sure, why not? Come on. Actually, we don't need this anymore, right? Let's get rid of that. There. Oh, come on. Which is also a new kind of thing, if I remember correctly, from the Alpha. You can lock the bolt back. There we go. And you can top it up, but... go but I don't need to do that I think this is ready yeah okay there we go all right let's see should I get rid of the uh, RPK hmm maybe maybe I do have a lot more hmm I do have the Ultimax yeah you know what Get rid of that. Override token found. Okay. Let's see what we get here. Oh, the MP5. <laughs> right. Oh, just no space for it though. Well, I can't do that. Oh, I got to do that. Yep. All right. Well, this is going to be nice. Suppressed, make things a little bit easier. Oh. Okay, good. I hear them. Let me just uh, shoot these guys first. Nope, okay. <laughs> I thought I heard them, but... Uh... All right, you know what? Let's get on with it. Let's go to the hold point. And uh, everything should be good. I don't know. I forgot if I reloaded the Ultimax, but whatever. Interfacing with system node. Okay, where am I going to go? Where am I going to go? <laughs> Analyzing system. No good spots. No good spots. Whoops. Okay. You know, Ultimax time. Oh, I did not reload this. Yeah, they just love using their shields, don't they? Get in, get in. Oh. <laughs> oh, he's always have trouble putting that clip into the Garand. Side, there we go. I need a little bit more practice one day. These guys with shields. Maybe that's why I should stick with the Ultimax. Mm -hmm. Okay. Good stuff. Whoops. My controller's freaking out again. Stop, 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 stop. I'm not even aiming. 
They're a little too close for the scope. I only use the Ultimax when I really need it. Oh, that's a grenade! Oh, no, I'm out. Okay, I really need the Ultimax. Oh, man, my hand is cramping. I really hate it when that happens. Get in the... Oh, nope. I didn't lock open. This is bad. <laughs> didn't lock it open properly. I really need more practice with the uh, Garand. some cover. Oh, this is bad. That's a grenade. That's a grenade. <laughs> that's not good. There's just no good cover over here, huh? I could go over there, but, uh... Okay, maybe I should uh, not play with targets because this is getting getting pretty hard, especially with my hand uh, not working properly. Oh man, just don't understand what's going on with my hands nowadays. Price of getting older, I suppose. Oh, this is painful. This is just painful, man. I need this thing to end so I can. Uh, Relax my hand. Oh man, I just, oh, there we go, finally. Hold on guys, just a second. Need to uh, deal with my hand for a bit. Oh, come on. Don't know why my hands keep cramping up, especially my left hand. That's not good. Ouch. Oh, there we go. Come on. Oh, man. Don't know why it's happening nowadays, but uh, need to need to figure out a way to not, like, make my hands ache. Okay. Uh, if I... No, that's still going to be pretty bad. Just want to grab the controller, just, uh, you know... It's not good. Okay. I'm gonna have to switch hands for a bit. And I'm gonna have to, uh, I'm just gonna do this one handed since the Ultimax is pretty good. Thankfully, the Ultimax is so accurate that uh, you can fire it one handed. Which is <laughs> pretty good, I'll tell you that right now. Although I can't really aim, because I'm not using my dominant eye. Oh, 
Goodness gracious. Yeah, this is why I don't really play that much. Okay, cool. Ooh, okay. Just need to not use the rest of my hand. I'm, use, I'm just using the thumb and my index finger right now to uh, press the uh, the locomotion button so I can move at least. But sorry to say, I'm gonna have to just pretend that I my my other hand my other arm got shot or something. <laughs> so I'm just using one hand, uh, one arm. Okay. Override token found. Oh, come on. All right. Cleared out all of the the um, supply rooms. Oof. I don't know if I'll buy anything, but uh, yeah. Now, you know what? I'm just going to go and try to clear out the hold. Yeah, sorry. I'm just, uh, I'm just adjusting my grip on my controller here with my left hand. It's just... I really want <laughs> I really want to use it. But uh we'll see how it goes. Let's see uh, what the uh next couple of uh, like Rambo except uh not an M60. Over there. <laughs> this is so fun shooting one-handed though. I need to get out of here. Oh, goodness. Yep. I'm lucky that they didn't shoot me. Got him. <laughs> this gun is really, really good, especially if you use a one-handed. All right, I think I might be okay. Just, uh... I have to position my hand. I, I, yeah, I know you guys can't see it, but it's, it's a weird, funky position I'm trying to put my hand in so that I don't uh, cause it to cramp up. But uh, yeah, let's uh, let's do this. Interfacing with system node. Hold this position. Oh, I need a spot. I need to find a spot. You know, you know how you hold like a teacup, right? With your like, with your pinky out? Kind of the way I'm holding my controller right now. So just imagine that kind of visual. I got my thumb on the, um, the locomotion button, the movement button. And then my, f my index finger is on the uh, trigger. And then like the other two fingers on the main body. Oh, the oh goodness. And then my pinky, I think my pinky is the one that's the causing the problem. All right, you know what? I'm gonna try shooting with a, oh, I didn't reload this thing. There we go. Let's reload this thing. Advancing to next system layer. Okay. Well, I guess this this works. My pinky is out. <laughs> I'm holding the guns in a weird position. Oh. Okay. Well. 
No, you don't. Good. Oh. Little smoke. Yeah, this is actually working for me. I'm good with this. I just have to adjust my grip on my controller. Come on, where are you? There you are. Ooh, threw another smoke, huh? Okay, oops. Ah. Damn you. Spotted me. There you are. Encryption neutralized. Oh man. Advancing. Get in, get in the thing. There we go. Oh, I need to find a space. Analyzing system. Coming out this way. Maybe not. All right. Well, he's got the uh, level three armor, or whatever it's called. I shot him anyways. Are you? Where'd you go? Huh? There you are. I was wondering where you went. Okay. Oh man. Five override tokens found. Advance to next system node and take it. I forgot what uh, level I'm at, but uh, I'm just gonna take a little bit of a breather right here and clean up some of my mess and make sure that my hand is not going to mess up my game. And okay. Let's go get back up from the chair. <laughs> nice to have a chair. Okay, all right. Oh no, they spotted me. There we go. That's how you lock it open. Get out of here. Got him. Oh, dear. oh, goodness. Oh, 
are you like, did you come from somewhere else? Oh, I thought I got you. Whatever. Okay. Oh yeah, that's right. I completely forgot I had the uh, MP5 SD6. Okay, cool. <laughs> I forgot that I had this thing. Okay, well. Oh, sorry. Wait a minute. Okay, cool. God, I completely had this. Alright, well. Oh, man. Should I get rid of something? Oh, maybe I should. Let's get, uh, let's change it up a bit. Keeping the Ultimax, of course. Oh, well, there's no way to get rid of it then. <laughs> well, forget about it then. I guess we're going to move on to the next hold with these weapons. I run out of ammo for the, gar the Garand. I'm just going to switch to the Ultimax. Whoops, I'm out of ammo. All right. Oh, that was a grenade, and my cans are cramping again. Stop, 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 stop. Get down. Whoops. Sorry, uh, hands cramping again. Hmm, that was weird. All right, let me just uh, make sure my hands don't cramp too much. And let's get back to this. Whew. Okay. Interfacing with system node. Hold this position. Analyzing system. Well, wow, that was <laughs> pretty uh, good. Not too bad. Five hold might have been a little too much. Well, that's not good. Ten seconds. Got him. Oh, hold on. Did that not. Fine. We'll just use the Ultimax. Actually. Okay, this is not a good spot. Why? Oh, no, because I used the bipod. Oh, I forgot. Come on. There you are. I see. No, you don't. Couple more, 
coming in through here. Okay. Yep, this is good. This is great. Analyzing system. Oh, my hands are cramping. Damn, this is not good. Fine. One handed. I'm just going to do this one-handed. Oops. Didn't quite reload that properly. There we go, finally got him. Twelve seconds? Sixteen. Fifteen. Okay. All right. This is not good. This is not good. Oh, there you go. Goodness. <laughs> All right. Oh, man. That was... Uh... Five override tokens found. <sighs> Advance to next system node and take it. Oh, let me just sit down here for a bit. If only my hands didn't start cramping. You know, that's that's the only thing right there. It's just the... Uh, like my left hand, especially my left hand, is just... uh. It's not great, but, uh, yeah, you know, I'll just, uh, you know, I'll just, uh, try to, try to play <laughs> the best I can. But, uh, yeah, this thing is laser accurate, especially one-handed. Just need to dial it in. Once you do, oops, my 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 left hand's cramping again. Ah, oh, okay, that's just yeah, something's wrong there. Okay, okay, no, 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 it's uh, not going away. That's really weird. Ah, uh, anyways, that, that's about it for today. I just need to I need to deal with this. My left hand is just not working properly. But uh, yeah, anyways, that's about it for today, and. Um, well, I'll see you guys next time.